Hallelujah, hallelujah. To God be the glory for all the good things he's done in our lives. Hallelujah, praise the Lord. Love you. Remember Jesus Christ dealing with that. No, he hasn't. He did not. You talking about, talking about when that woman was an act of adultery. Yeah. That was basic compassion. Yeah. The people he fought was the people that were, you know, religious. Yeah. Yeah. And and, and that's what I wanted to do to, to, and I, I was hoping the brother would show up was the fact is look at the impact of hardness of heart when you sit there and, and forget that sin is sin and that you have it and you have an area that somebody else could easily have indignation of. You know what I mean? Yeah, that, that's that's something that uh, just came to my I mind. Mean, just came to my mind. Mm -hmm. We <laughs> did not conquer sin. Come on, brother. No. So no. It, 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 it was only one man. Come on now. And that was our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Right. That conquered sin. Right. Okay. So who are we uh -huh. to show any ill will toward anyone Come on. who is struggling hey, with, uh, with sin? Hey, look. Hey, Brother Isaac, in my flesh, dwell is no good thing. Oh, those things that I would do. Come on, brother. I do not. Right. <laughs> Now that's Paul talking, yeah. right? <laughs> so yeah. we, when we sit there looking at the uh, people, maybe in a certain certain behavior, we 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 automatically thinking that they have a choice. Man, yeah. you talking about the Pharisee of the Pharisee, <laughs> <laughs> a man that took three years in a desert Come on. to figure out and, and was with Christ in the spirit. <laughs> I'm gonna tell you a shipwreck. I've been telling you, well, oh, come on, that dude went through some stuff, man. Huh? And, and, and so, so I'm saying is that that's why you, and, and like I said, I think that's the whole purpose. Jesus showed that parable about the, not the story about that woman calling an act of adultery, and he walked around and looked around. He's saying this, y'all, number y'all, what? Let me think about my eyes and look at it. No, what? Why are y'all angry enough that you want to kill some, kill a person? Where, where did that anger come from? You, that person did something wrong, and now I'm telling every last one of y'all, y'all did something wrong too. Yeah, you know, but, when when you think about this, when your first emotions come up, yeah, you need to check, sit back, and check. If you exactly because what is expected may not be what is is necessary right it may not be what god's god how god wants you to move because those people were they were they were acting out according to the law yeah which was trying to control the flesh not, not the spirit not the spirit you it, know and so they acted out in in a fleshly way exactly and not 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 in a spiritual not being spiritually minded, you know, which is 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 to to have compassion, to have you know, love, right. patience, right? You know, all, all all those 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 fruits, and uh, I find it amazing that that you you have the author. <laughs> The author of of, uh, of of God's word sitting here saying, you know, there's more to it than what you exactly than what you see. Right, the woman in the well. There was more to it than what you saw. Yeah, he, he said, rightly so. That's not your husband. You you right. <laughs> yeah, I know that ain't your husband. Yeah, my uh, fact, you have five of them. <laughs> right, and 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 and. I, I mean, you've seen in the church before how many people would play those cards when we talked about sin. We've seen it. We, you know, yeah. you've seen it. And, and, and we asked the question. You asked the question one time, and all of us asked that question sometime in this Bible study, that 
when I bring this slide up again, and we're talking about the fact is that he's telling you to go preach the gospel, but he addressed something first, which was unbelief and hardness of heart, right? Right? Yeah. yeah. Look, now read this scripture from a different perspective. All right? I'm going to bring it up. And I'm telling you and asking you to consider moving unbelief and hardness of heart to your fellow man, regardless of their transgressions. And now see why he can tell you from 15 to 20. Okay. Oh yeah, you, you have to, <laughs> just when it first starts off, you know, go ye into all the world. You can't do that with a hard heart. You can't do that with a I mean, because look, he says the world. He said the world, brother. The world. So when I think the world, there's some of everything in the world. There's some of everything. You you talk, you preaching now. Everything is in the world. You're gonna find that Roman in the world. Hey, yeah. Samaritan is in that world. Man, there were some barbarians, there was some 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 people who practiced witchcraft. There was some of everything. Everything, murderers. Yeah. Yeah. Think about it. He said, I had to get that hardness of your heart out of the way because I want you to go into all the world and look, preach the good news. To every preacher. He even put it in and say it every preacher. I guess, I guess <laughs> so, so murderers are not a part of every. Yes, sir. Homosexuals are not a part of every. How about that? Adulterers, that they, they don't fit in every. <laughs> Devil worshippers, they, they definitely don't fit in every. <laughs> and that's facetious because you're saying that they do. Yeah, yeah, because they because every is every creature. It's everything. Ain't nothing left out of it. And when he say creature, I'm thinking if, if they fly, if they swim, <laughs> if 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 they if they live in yes, sir. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, you know what? I'm gonna start speaking the gospel to 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 living creatures. There you go. Hey, look. And the other thing too, when you say go in the world, that that means I I ain't tell y'all go preach in the, in the four walls. Yeah, not not into the not into a, a sanctuary. Uh huh. Uh huh. Because he would have said that. He come on, brother. Go ye into all the sanctuaries <laughs> and share this good news to I, every creature. Uh uh. So, so that means is the, the club is in the world. Oh, oh, no, no, no. That's that the club people in the club that they don't fall under every creature. <laughs> or oh, in the world either, right? They they not in the world, right? No, they no, they not in this world. In world. What in the world? No, sir. Look, the whole houses ain't in this world. The, 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 the brothels, the uh, the street corners. Come on, the now. ghettos. Come on. You know the the hood. Come on. The hey. gangsters ain't in, 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 they, they not, they not a creature. <laughs> hey, and also, I'm going to put this down for a second. That way people can see it. But look, <laughs> <laughs> the, the point is that you ain't going to also go in there with hardness of heart saying you're all going to hell. <laughs> oh, you, you, you stiff neck <laughs> people, y'all going straight to hell. <laughs> There's a place for each and every last one of y'all, <laughs> unless you receive Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior. You're going to hell. Y'all going to hell. <laughs> you're going to burn in your gnashing of teeth. <laughs> See that? Huh? That doesn't sound like good news, does it? No, ain't no good news in that. The good <laughs> news is that you've been freed from that if, if you believe. You believe. And he, you know, and I think at one one that time where he actually went to, I think it was Levi's house, and, mm -hmm. and, and he, Levi invited all his friends and and the the the, 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 the religious people were on the outside, and it sounded yeah. like, it sounded like you, you kind of proud all of them. Well, look, Jesus obviously could hear them, right? Yeah, they, they don't want to talk to the disciples, but Jesus spoke up. He said, uh, he did. He does not sit. Don't need a physician. Yeah. 
<laughs> so I mean, I mean, he was the empire, right? Yeah. <laughs> I, my my point is that we 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 going down like, oh, I can't stand sin. I can't stand you know. Y'all seen? I have some of my, some of my old uh, church people that back in Korea. Uh, this one lady, uh, she was a sergeant major's wife, and she knows if she ever look at this video, she would say, "You talking about me? You talking about me?" But I ain't calling your name out. But what was that? She she always showed that I can't stand sin. I'm not gonna tolerate it. Well. You projecting your your disgust though, yeah, on the person for, for, for the person. Now look, I can't stand sin in my life. Yeah, yeah. When 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 it affects me. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. The sin in someone, I have compassion mm -hmm. for someone who is who is living in sin, who yeah. is because I don't think it's anybody's desire to be that way. Come on, come on. You know, I think that that is just a nature that they had inherited. Yes, and sir. if they could live knowing uh -huh. that there is a better way, right? then they would. Because we need to understand their eyes uh -huh. have been blinded come on. so that they don't understand yes, sir. or even know the 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 state of 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 life that they're in walking in darkness what you mean right they're they're zombies they're they are the walking dead right hey, hey but here's the thing i want to throw at you i want to i want to throw something for consideration for those who are not saved and then those who are saved the people that are saved their flesh what they walk in sin they, they, their flesh is that what the scripture said? In my flesh dwell is no good thing. No good thing. It's always worn against God. You see what I'm saying? And so that means even a believer who has overcome some areas uh, you, you know, deal with sin daily. You wake daily. up with daily. sin of the flesh with you daily. And therefore you should humble yourself because you know that hell, man, I, I got to fight this thing daily. That's why even we're talking about the script, the, you know, the title, uh, yesterday, Sunday, walking by faith daily. Daily, yeah. Because you are, and, and you're as interested. Remember, said, "Take no thought for tomorrow." Yeah. Because sufficient unto the day, sufficient unto the day, yeah. sufficient unto the day is the evil thereof. You, you, me, anybody out there, sufficient unto the day that you got to deal with daily. Alien. And you know that flesh tug on you every day, does it not? Every single day. You oh. know, Pastor, there was a time. Yes, sir. Uh, when I made a conscious effort not to sin, I'd wake up, go into prayer, and I'm not gonna sin today. I'm gonna get through this day, and I'm not gonna sin. Uh -huh. I'm still trying to get through that day. Tell, tell me about it, brother. And to me, and I'm talking about this is over 30, 30 years ago. Tell me about it. Because that, you see what does, it does make you humble, though. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah. Makes you but, well, you know what else makes let you know? What? Now, there may have been days that I did not see it. Okay. But it's not by my effort. If I try, there's is, is the failure is already there. Already there. I'm yeah. already setting myself because this flesh, there's no good thing what none. this flesh can do. None. There's none. That's the whole point. And, and, so, and when and and if I could do it in and of myself, then Jesus would never have come. Come on, brother. That's not. Oh yeah. That that's the other part I forgot to say, and I said on this this Sunday, then it go out. It will go out. I'm telling you is that when you come into the body of christ you come in with all that junk i've been one time one of my brothers and said i don't see where it's written that you come as you are but we know that great wedding feast he said go out into the highway yeah right, and the byways and bring the yeah. in the van bring them in here yeah he did he said i want my house to be empty 
bring them in here. That tells me, I don't know about anybody else, but that tells me you come as you are. Yeah. Uh, another scripture that talked about the fact is come in as a child. Yeah. And that means he said, be a child. He didn't say be a child. Yeah. He said, come as a child, meaning someone that's new into something without a lot of understanding. Come on in. See, a person that's an alcoholic knows about drinking. Mm -hmm. And he, he he can he can pull back that all the time. And that's tugging on him all the time. And if you as a believer, you as a believer, and that's what we're trying to say, everybody listen to this, because that, that comment that was made about being a, a narrow-minded, bigot Christian, that's exactly what a person sees when somebody is trying to put them down, show anger, hardness of heart toward them because they are not where they the other person wants them to be and and the other part about the fact is that they forgot how they were and they forgot such were some of you, <laughs> you get pissed, i like that bishop had that in that i mean yeah, he ate me up with that one <laughs> yeah, right. such as some of you and and therefore you should have compassion it, and i asked the brother ellen last night i said is how long were you uh, uh alcoholic you know, and he said it took a long time for the Lord to to deliver me from that. And I said, well, so when you minister to people with maybe a different lifestyle, when you minister to a prostitute, uh, how long, brother? I think you'd rather have. How long would it take that person to, to be delivered from being a prostitute? It all depends on what God does. And it, it is an individual. Because it could be in a twinkling of an eye. It could be. And? Or it could be my grace is sufficient. <laughs> and you're going to walk with that thorn. Yeah. And you just got to over, overcome it. And, and what, what you supposed to do? Is that supposed pain? to believe. You, you renew your mind. Yeah, and you allow the Holy Spirit. Right. To, to to make that change right my point we change from within not 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 we change from the inside out right not from the outside in well what i'm saying is to tell believers the believer who has someone and many of us all of us have something but let's talk about the big one that's easy to identify right uh -huh. so let's talk about what do you do with a male prostitute so your wife because you know you know your wife will have a problem with you you trying to deal with a female uh -huh. prostitute, but a gigolo, right? How do you treat them? How are you supposed to treat them? And when is it that you don't supposed to treat them a certain way? Okay, you know? well, you always treat them in love. That's the whole point. And, 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 that, and that's, 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 that's it, period. Because yeah. even Jesus said, they'll know you. By the love you have for one another. By the love you have for one another. You, you, how else can you be determined to be a disciple of Jesus Christ? Yeah. And how you know, do you have that person deliver if you don't show love? Yeah. Also discuss. And that's all I'm trying to say is that regardless of the situation, there is no, like you said, I like the fact you're saying is that Sunday, see, if we sit there now, start to, and that's, a, that's really a bad thing. When we sit there and start putting balances on sin, say, okay, well, your sin is not as bad as this sin. You know, oh, your sin is not bad. This sin is worse than this sin. Therefore, I'm going to treat this sin different from, from that sin. The world, we, we run the people we're trying to bring in to grow in Christ away from Christ. Man, and, and this is this is this is what's what's crazy. If you're trying to and it's really not sin, it's the fruit of sin. It is the fruit of sin. Yeah. Because the sin is not adhering to God's word. No. No. The, the, that's the sin. Yes, sir. The the fruit of the sin is that 
the disconnection right. from God. Yeah. And the fruit of that yeah. is all types yes, sir. Of, of, of fleshly desires. Right. Right. So God is a spirit. Yes, sir. And if you're going to worship him, right. to serve him, right. it must be done in spirit and in truth. And in truth. And in truth. Not in, in how someone makes my flesh crawl. Yes, sir. Because of what they do. But they do. Somebody's weakness. Yeah. So you, I think you discussed it because you, you're really mad at yourself because you had that weakness. Yeah, I ain't talking to you. Probably. I think that's there's a good chance. But the, the fact of it is, why are you dwelling <laughs> on on a fleshly desire to the point of it affecting your soul? Yeah. yeah. To yeah. where you can't minister to somebody. Hey, look, why would you think that's that person behavior and any laws that protect a certain behavior? Is a threat to you. It, 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 it's really not. And 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 how how can you think so small of God? Woo! Woo! How can you how can you think so small of the redemptive work of Jesus Christ that has been done in, in us? Yes, sir. That we have we have been sealed. <laughs> oh, come on now! By the Holy Spirit. That's a scripture word. That's a scripture, right? That's a scripture. Yes, sir. Yeah, the purchase possession. Yes, sir. We we've been sealed so that sin cannot separate us from God again. Come on. So you think so? Christ so we are new creations. How can I mean that is incapable of not showing love? Come on, and why would they the behavior? Why I mean, you know you hear that one cause of somebody to stumble? Wait a minute. If 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 your behavior is causing me to stumble, I need to check myself on how much word I there still get into. And there the, you go. Yes, sir. And this is, matter of fact, I wanted to bring this up to you. Another piece before I say that is, that's why some people don't come to ministry, don't come to Christ, yeah, or don't come to ministry because some people in the ministry want you to be right first before yeah. you come to Christ. Well, this is what's crazy. They want you to be at least as mature as they are. Yeah, Forget when you come that. in. You know, and then and then they wanna then they wanna put they want they wanna cover you in tablets. <laughs> you know, uh, uh words of stone yes, instead of words of love. Come on, brother. Uh, they're gonna beat you down with the Ten Commandments. Right. They're gonna beat you down with the law. Ain't no love in that. There ain't no love in that. And it is my fact and, and, and who wants to be a part of that? I know it. That's the problem. If who, I, who, how are you drawing someone by showing disdain? Yes, sir. For a a prison sentence that they're enduring. Come on now, and hey, look, look, and now that's why. Or, I, or or a habit. Yes, sir. And that's why I want because we what and it's shifting a little bit. Same topic, but shifting a little bit. And we ask, how come this is not happening? And maybe, as we read the rest of this verse, and you can read it for us, I get that anointed in there. If you go ahead, you you started with fifteen. Okay, I'll go to uh, I'll read fifteen, sixteen, and fifteen, and go on down. Yes, sir. And he said unto them, Go ye into all the world, and preach the gospel to every creature. He that believeth and is baptized shall be saved. Yes, sir. But he that believeth not shall be damned. Yes, sir. And these signs shall follow them that believe. Uh -uh. In my name yes, sir. shall they cast out devils. Uh -huh. They shall speak with new tongues. Yes, sir. They shall take up serpents uh -huh. 
and if they drink any deadly thing, it shall not hurt them. Well, they shall lay hands on the sick. Well, they shall recover. Yes. So then, after the Lord had spoken unto them, he was received up into heaven and sat on the right hand of God. So that sounds like the book of Acts when he went up, was caught up. Yeah. yeah. So that means that there was other conversations. This almost as he might have made that a Brady. Well, see, this, this is what's, what, what I get out of this. This, when he sat down, the Sabbath began. Yes, sir. The rest. And we have been in the Sabbath ever since. Right. Because it didn't say he went up to heaven uh, and worked. Uh uh. Uh uh. He sat down. He sat down. Come on now. And rest <laughs> because it is finished. Yes, sir. Now go.